Well, I'm O.P. Yadav. I'm the Chief Cardiac Surgeon and the Chief Executive Officer of the National Heart Institute in New Delhi. One thing is for sure, it has been shown in a number of studies that bypasses do not reduce the total incidence of heart attacks. It only reduces the incidence of fatal heart attacks. But overall bypass uh, heart attacks is not reduced. And that's not difficult to understand because you don't bypass the side branches, the microcirculation. Each coronary artery branches 10 to 14 times before it becomes a capillary. And beyond the major artery in the first degree branch, we can't even see the coronary artery. They're all microscopic. And cholesterol doesn't just block the major artery. It also saturates the microcirculation. So whenever we do bypass surgery on an angioplasty, we do not ever give global revascularization. There are certain areas which would continue to be ischemic and therefore bypass sur uh, surgery does not restore entire blood supply to every single cell of the myocardium. Therefore bypass does not totally obviate the risk of a heart attack and in the PREVENT4 study it has been shown that if the graft has failed then roughly 3% of patients would get a heart attack within the first year and if the graft has not failed even then 0.5 that is half percent of patients following a bypass surgery may get a heart attack during the first year. But this will all depend on how well you look after yourself, how well you alter your lifestyle and how well you look after the coronary risk factors which have been identified in your case.